Hey there, Survivors. Cougar here, back with more Raft gameplay. We are not picking up right where we left off at the end of the last episode, and I'll tell you why. Because I'm a complete idiot, and I recorded an entire episode with my mic muted. <laughs> so let me just quickly walk you through some of the improvements we've done here. Uh, since the last time we talked, I have built a permanent anchor. Huge, huge, huge upgrade. Really a game changer, this. Uh, it took a lot of metal to do, a lot of metal that we've been smelting here. Speaking of which, it's time to pick up another piece of metal and smelt a new one. Um, but yeah, what a game changer. It allows you to just park yourself wherever you want to, whenever you want you want to. Great big deal. Another improvement that we've made is we were able to... So I, I, I made a piece of glass in the smelter, and then I researched the glass at the research table, and now we were able to build the improved advanced purifier. So this is great. It's solar powered. You just dump some, your seawater in there. It evaporates up onto the glass. It runs down the glass and the fresh water collects in there. And the salt stays in the original bucket. I also, we got rid of the small, the two small crop plots that we had that was that we were growing uh, the potatoes and, and beets in and in, instead planted another, I created another of the medium ones. So we are growing a lot of watermelons now. Uh, also, um, also, I got a bunch of bricks ready. These bricks are now ready. I thought it felt like we needed a second smelter because the smelting is just going kind of slowly right now. I need to smelt metal ore. I need to smelt copper. I need to smelt uh, the seaweed. And I'm just noticing that I'm not seeing Bruce around here. And I, I'm, I don't know exactly when this save was made. I think it, it the save happened right after we killed Bruce, but before I was able to harvest the meat off him. So I think that meat is gone, unless I put it in one of these. No, I didn't put it in one of these. That meat is gone, but Bruce, I think, is not around here right now. So I think that we can go back down and do immediately do some more gathering here. I've already done some in this location, but there's some around the corner that we could go to as well. So, yeah. Oop, nope, Bruce is here. Okay, I'm. he's back. I did not see him before. Should we try stabbing him in the f gullet? There we go. See, I'm learning, guys. I'm improving. I'm able to actually stab him in the face. He won't stay that gone for that long, though. So if we want to go down there and do some more harvesting, and there is some more harvesting to do down there, it looks like, uh, we're either going to have to kill Bruce or make a fish bait, a shark bait. I don't have a shark bait, so that would require us to do some fishing. Yeah, I don't have a shark bait or anything to, I could use to make shark bait. So uh, why don't I do a little bit of fishing? Oh, another improvement that we've done since the last time, I made a metal hook instead of the plastic hook. Our plastic hook was destroyed, but then we had the materials that we needed to make a metal plast uh, hook. Uh, this metal hook is almost uh, destroyed, actually. I'm going to have to make a new one soon. Also, because our fishing rod was almost gone, I made a metal fishing rod, too. So now we have a metal fishing rod. So good. Uh, why don't I just do a little bit of... It looks like the sun is going down now. So why don't I just spend the night doing some fishing and getting some, uh, uh, some shark bait made. And then in the morning we'll come back and do a little bit more harvesting down here using the shark bait. Oh, get away. Get, get off. Okay, that broke our fishing rod. That's fine. So I, I've got a scarecrow up here protecting this one, and then, then I've got a scarecrow down here protecting this one as well. So we broke our fishing rod. Uh, gonna have to do another one now. Okay, we killed Bruce. All right, so this save was made right before we had killed him last time. And now he's dead, and we are full up on shark meat. And this is fantastic because it means that we can now go down and harvest up whatever we want to down there. Shoot, except I have no planks. I have no planks at all. And it looks like I already harvested, well, at least one tree off of this. But it looks like there's another tree over there. Let me quickly just run over and bang on that tree for a minute get a couple more planks so i can repair that board 
and then we'll go down and do some harvesting some undersea harvesting Oh, and I'm very hungry, but we just picked up a couple of coconuts, so we can take care of that immediately. And look at my, how many watermelons I have on the far right end of my toolbar there. I've got 13 watermelons, having uh, switched out the small grow plots for the large ones. Um, I think we, we're going to get a few more harvests out of this hook before it breaks, so I'm not going to worry about making another one right this second. Uh, I've got a few clams already. Yeah, and that's going to that's gonna fill up our inventory. Let me go back up and clear out the inventory a little bit. I've got room for this now. Just That's fish. That can go there. Salt can go here. Um, the goo can go here. The shark's head can go here. And we can start cooking up this Oh, we've got a cooked salmon waiting for us on our large grill. We can put down another one. Yeah, let's do that. And store... Hold on. Right, this one's supposed to be for food but stuffs, but it's kind of full. So we'll put the rest of the shark meat here for the time being and dive back down and do some more harvesting. Scrap. This looks like sand. Yep, I'm learning what these things look like now. Uh, we're going to be on the lookout for more metal, but we've already gotten a bunch of metal off of here. That's, where there, I have, that's why I have 13 metal in my inventory. There's metal, metal ore. So we missed one at least. Oh, there's two more it looks like over there. We need this seaweed to make the vine goo. Next on our crafting priorities is going to be... I'm going to eat some salmon as long as we're out here. I'm just getting a little hungry. Actually, I can probably eat this entire salmon up, but look how, how high it gets our... Okay, we, we broke our metal hook. I'm either going to have to make a new one, or if I can't, I'll just make a plastic one right now. Yeah, we're going to need more planks and bolts. I could make a bolt right now, but yeah... It's the planks. It's the planks that are going to mess us up. I'm just going to make a plastic hook for now. And yeah, there are seagulls on our stuff, but I've got the scarecrows down. We are up to 14 metal ore. That's fantastic. And a bunch of seaweed here, too. This is great. It's just what we need. Oh, is that more metal ore? More metal ore. Oh, are you back already? I just killed you. Ah, I was a little slow with that. Let's not risk it. Let's get out of here. Whoa, whoa, going the wrong way. Well, now we're going to have to risk it. Now he's definitely going to attack us again before we get back to shore. So I'm just going to wait for him if I can. <laughs> slow again. Now we're down to, like, no health. Oh, boy, I got to get out of the water. Hoo, hoo, hoo. We could not have taken another hit. He would have killed us. Oh, boy. That was close. All right, let me get something smelting while we're here. And then I, I think I'll go back and do a little bit more fishing and try to get a shark bait made. Let us... I'll smelt another metal. Although what I really want is the vine goo, so I'm going to smelt some seaweed here for now. Oh, well, okay, that's fine. I put metal down accidentally. And then we got to get another smelter built. Oh yeah, thank you. Another improvement that I made. Thank you for the tip about making a, a torch, a lantern, and especially for the tip about not having to put it on the floor. There are multiple ways you can mount these and, you know, to save valuable real estate here on the raft. I have it hanging up there. Uh, okay, so I'm going to do back to a little bit of fishing. This is going to be kind of boring, so we'll pick this up when I've got enough to make a shark bait. Well, the sun is coming up, and I have been fishing all night long and catching nothing but mackerel and tilapia. So we do not have what we need to make our shark bait yet. Uh, get off there. Discourage him. Yep. And you. Ah, still want to get a stick in on one of them because we need feathers to harvest. I, I should... 
what I should do is make one of those birds nests because that way we it'll give us a, a better chance of no we don't want the hook sorry I want the fishing rod uh, the birds nest would give us a chance to stab them a little bit more regularly also you get eggs from them which you need in the more advanced recipes once we have a cooking pot which we don't yet but we probably could make raw salmon uh, I only have that one pomfret I just need one other either pomfret or herring to make a shark bait And yes, guys, I will get more collection nets down on the front of my raft. I know everybody says that's a really good idea and I should be doing it. Uh, to this point, however, I, I've just kind of been enjoying getting to know the hook, how the hook works, and trying to get better at it. So I'm sorry if it's been really boring watching me collect all that stuff with the hook recently, but I, I've been enjoying it, so... So not, I haven't been in a huge hurry to get all those collection nets built. Another salmon. So it's we've got two salmon, like four mackerels, and two tilapias. And no herring and no pomfret. Another tilapia. Is there any method to this madness? Does anybody know? I mean, is, is there any way to, like, based on the depth that you're casting into or how far out you're casting or anything like that. Is there any way to have some control over what you're getting? Another mackerel. It's like six mackerel now. Or is it just totally random? Because we have used up half of our metal fishing rod's health so far and not caught a single... There's a herring. Okay, great. Now we've got a pomfret on the sh on the raft. In here, I think, wasn't it? Yes. Pomfret and the herring. I'm just full. Oh, he's back. Yeah. And I am very low on planks. In fact, we're out. We're completely out of planks now. Hang on, let me just dump something in here. Oh, nope, now I have a little bit of room because we used up all our planks. So now I can use the, take the pomfret, put the, let's put the mackerel in there and make our, go to tools, shark bait, craft. Let's just store the seaweed for now. We got a bunch now, that's great. Store the rest of these fish. We're not going to need. Uh, let me just get a sip of water before we head out. Yeah, what I really want to craft next is that plastic water bottle. It's going to make staying hydrated and watering crops much easier. But for that, I need a bunch of vine goo. We've probably got enough seaweed to make that happen right now. It's just going to take a while to smelt it all. Do we... Now, uh, let me put... Uh, I already dropped it. I just take one seaweed out of here and put it in our smelter. Do you need planks? It probably needs planks or will need planks soon. Unfortunately, I can't really help with that because we're out of planks. There you go, Brucey. Enjoy. Get out. Oh, I stabbed him once. I stabbed one of those seagulls once. I think maybe I have to hit him twice to kill him. Not so interested in the stones. I think we have a lot of stones. I will be looking for clay, scrap metal, and metal ore. And sand. Beyond the smelter, I haven't seen anything that requires... I'm going to skip that clan. We have a at least two already. I haven't seen anything beyond the smelter that requires the bricks, but that doesn't mean that they don't. It doesn't exist. I may just not have had call to explore that avenue yet. Copper. Um, 
get a little, I'll pick up a little bit more seaweed. Got lots of seaweed now. That's just stone, but it, we're right here on the surface. Might as well. More stone. Yeah, that was quick. You're back quick. That hardly took any time at all, Bruce. Or I was slow. All right, well, we're not going to hang around here and do more fishing just to make another shark bait. Let's just finish clearing this island. I think we got all the fruit off it. I think we, I already had already picked up the watermelon and the pineapples from here. So let me just see if there's another uh, tree up at the top, or maybe even two trees for some planks and possibly fruit, hanging fruit. Nope, I already got the trees up here. And we already got whatever was here. There was a, a chest there. Some good stuff in it, probably. I don't remember. Oh, there's going to be a plank that's going to float up above the sand right here in just a second if the water comes back. Yep, there it is. Cool. Now we've got a plank. All right, mateys, let us weigh anchor and get out of here. Yeah, that's great. Love it. Trim the mizzen mast. We're heading south or something. Good enough? Good enough. Oh, nope, maybe not good enough. seem to be hung up on a rock right there. Whoa! We just went on a merry-go-round ride. Get off. Yeah, love me the I love this metal spear. It only takes two hits to get him off the raft now. Whoa! Spinning around again. I may need to use the paddle to get us out of here. We seem to be a little bit wedged in. Yes, I'm very, very hungry, but I've got 13 watermelons to eat. And a big cooked salmon. And a lot of mackerel. Let's eat up that. Oh, I've got some shark meat here, too. Let's just go drift and put some more food down. All this shark meat. And one more on here. And then top priority now is going to be planks out here. All right, let's see if we can make some more collection nets. No, because we need planks for that. Okay, so I'm going to have to do some hooking for a while. Sorry. put that salmon away. That'll still be good tomorrow. Get rid of the... Well, wait a minute. Did this finish cooking? Okay, good. We've got one vine goo, and then there were two in the storage, I think. So now we've got three. Four. We got four, which may be enough to make that plastic bottle that I want. Four vine goo. There we go. Craft it up. Plastic and vine goo. Great. So now, if I can remember where the our new thing is, now we can fill this up. And you see it has a bar at the bottom down in the toolbar that tells you how full it is. Great. So that's completely full. Now I can fill... Whoops. Mm, Butterfingers. I can fill this up from the cup. Sorry, I was just making you dizzy. I think that's probably it. Oh, I need that plank. 
yeah, we're probably going to get bitten here, but... Did I get the plank? Okay, it's full. Oh, I got some more watermelons to harvest. Yep. Let's eat this beet. Eat the beet. Beet eating time. Yeah, we got so we got two more watermelons down here and two more up there. Replant the watermelon seeds and use our fancy new bottle. Let's christen our new bottle by watering our crops. Which way are we drifting? That way. Here comes a barrel. And a couple more barrels out there. But we got other stuff we have to do. Like make more collection nets. Mm, um, two planks in a row. Nope, and I missed both of them. Because I'm bad at this still. But I am improving. I'm sure of it. You just can't tell right now. That should be enough to make one more collection net. Mm, I missed a barrel. Ah, too far. How we're we doing on collection nets? We can make two collection nets. Okay. And what's forward in this raft? I guess that's that's forward, right? That's the bow. Is this the bow? Oh. Oh, good thing we got him because that's the piece that was already. Oh no, we repaired that. Okay. All right. Um, I guess I'm gonna pull up my first two nets here. I'm going to bust these planks up, get a one plank, one plastic back, and then put the collection nets here. And then eventually we'll be closing these in with another row of boards. I just don't have that many planks available to do more boards. Should we take this little bit of downtime to make our second smelter? Well, we need at least we still need lots of boards, planks. I'm I'm using the planks for so many different things right now. Crafting and smelting and cooking. Ugh, gosh darn it. I tell you honestly, when you guys aren't looking. I'm pretty good at this. I, I think it makes me nervous to know that you're all watching, judging me on my hooking skills. Many barrels coming. Our health is full. I'm going to swim around and grab a bunch of stuff here. Yes, we're probably going to take a hit from Brucey, but we'll be back to the raft before it gets serious. Okay. Whoop. All right. We're, we're so full of good stuff that we are actually, our inventory is actually full. I uh, can dump off. I can't dump off a potato because we have 20 potatoes in that other box. We can put the copper in here, put the clay, the sand in there, and make a bunch of rope to even out our inventory sitch. Uh, yes, I know there are barrels drifting by. I know. I'm sad about it, but what can I do? That's it. That's all we can afford to take from Bruce. Next hit. It's going to hurt a lot. There we go. Okay, that was a lot of planks. Let's see how we're doing here now.
All right, this is how you guys wanted me to do it, right? And close this front section, if this is the front section, whatever the front section is. Are we drifting right toward that island? Not really, but we've just been on an island. I think we're just going to drift for a little... Oh, we're pretty close to that island. Let's see, maybe the, the sail can get us over there without too much effort. Come on. Yeah, let's see. It's I mean, it's kind of perpendicular to our path, but maybe we'll be able to get over there. What next? We can now make another collection net. At least one, two, really. Bust this up. Mm, bust both of these up. No, I'm just going to do the one. I don't think I should have made two. I think we really only needed one there. Get off, silly birdie. I hit him again. Oh, he's dead. Hold to pick up. Yes, I got feathers and ah, meat, but I'm full. I hit him too. What can we dump off here? Um, dump off some feathers, some scrap, because we have a lot of scrap. We got two stacks of scrap. We got two stacks of rocks. Okay, let's go back and pick up whatever we left here. Raw drumstick. And vine goo. And let's do more metal smelting. And cooked shark is cooked. Need more planks on the big one. Let's eat up the big shark. And is that enough collection net, guys? We, between, we got one, two, three, four, five up here. Two back here. And now I've got another one that I made and probably shouldn't have, but now it's made, so... I guess we should put it to use somewhere. Whatever. Just stick it there for now. If it gets destroyed, it gets destroyed. There's more fish in the sea. Mm-hmm. Okay. That, that's... Sort of going to work, right? Yeah, I think I think we're drifting that way. We're supposed to be. Yeah, I think we're supposed to, well, we may supposed to be going that way. Whatever. I think we're going to make it to that island. Do we have a paddle? We don't even have a paddle. I need more planks. Oh, rats. Well, there are going to be trees on the island over there. That'll give us some planks. I need one more plank. Any plankies? I need one more plank to make a paddle, and there's no drifting stuff in front of us because we're using the sail. I'm just checking my, yeah, let's see what we can condense here. Vine goo, we've used up all, but it should be in here, I think. I should leave it in here is what I'm saying. Lots of copper to get smelting on. Oh, these drumsticks we should be cooking. Cook a drumstick here. I can probably pick up this small one now that the other ones are all done. Um, do I have a couple other things to put down there? Yeah, we can put down two tilapia along with this drumstick. Stash the last one. 
Are you going to... We're not making much progress toward that island. In fact, it feels like we're on the complete opposite side of it, and we're just sailing up against the current, which is going to take forever since I don't have a paddle to help us out. I'm going to say screw it. We just came off an island. There'll be plenty more islands out there for us to visit. Let's just get back to drifting. I stabbed him and killed him. He dead. Oh, that's right. Now we have feathers. Now I can research feathers. I am an intermediate bird hunter. Cool. Feather. Research. We can make paintbrush. We can make uh, arrows for a bow. A hammock. Let's you sleep through the night and can be used to revive incapacitated friends. What's next? Binoculars, oxygen bottle receiver. For that, we need a uh, circuit board. <coughs> do we know how to make a circuit board? We must. Or do we have to find one? Yeah, I know. You're thirsty. Chill. We got lots of watermelons. Fill with fresh water. Fill with salt water. Alright, we're back on the drift now. On the current. <laughs> Another one. We are getting pretty good at killing these birdies now that we're trying. And that's going to be a lot of drumsticks. Four drumsticks. And all these arrows. Excellent. Eat up some fish, some shark meat. He's getting pretty beat up. I think one or two more hits on him and... He'll be dead. I'd love it if we could kill him right when we arrive at an island so we have more time to swim around and gather. All right, should we try for this island? That island is actually on our path-ish. Come on. Yeah, that could work. Now we can make a paddle. Mm, we're a little far away. We don't really need the paddle quite yet. Just gonna try to angle the sail so it brings us in on the back side of that island. We don't have to play catch up. Mm, a little more. Yeah, Bruce, go away. We got food and water has ceased to be an issue, pretty much. I think we're pretty good on all that. Raw potato, planks, and plastic. Just dump off the potato. Oh, no, wait. Potato, seeds we don't need. I got to finish eating that salmon soon. It doesn't go bad, I don't think, right? fishing rod there for now. Uh, I'm going to put another metal in here. And we have lots of metal now. Oh, jeez. See, it's the distance thing. That's, that's the thing I haven't gotten, because what happens is I throw it at the right angle, but then by the time I, I reel it in, I've either missed it or it lands short, and that's a waste, too. Yeah, oh, we're missing the island. Uh, I'm going to use the paddle. Get us over there a little faster. We're almost there. And then when we get there, we don't really have to worry about staying there because we have our fancy new anchor. I'm 
a little hungry. Maybe I'll eat a bite of salmon while we drift. Yeah, we're, so we're on the wrong side of this now. Now we actually kind of, we're, we're going right against the current. So we actually kind of need my paddle. And hopefully the sail keeps us close while we go over and drop the anchor. Yeah. All right, let's do a quick explore here. Man, I love that anchor. I wish I'd known what a game changer that was a little bit earlier. Because, uh, yeah, I would have built one immediately. But of course, it, it took a lot of metal. So it wasn't something that I could necessarily have done right away. I did it probably about as early as I could have done it. Lumberjacking. Oops, pineapples and seeds. I want the seeds, too. We don't want the palm seeds, though. Not that interested. We have a couple, and we're not really in the market for growing our own trees quite yet. Ah, what am I dropping? If it's only mango seeds I'm dropping, that's okay. Do I have room to pick up a mango if I want to? There we go. Two mangoes. Cool. And more watermelons. Oh, I want the watermelon seeds too, though. Good. That'll condense, and that won't. Three watermelons. We got 14 watermelons on us and a bunch of seeds. And I'm going to have to sit here and do some fishing to make some shark bait so we can go down and harvest here. I also need to do a little bit of inventory juggling uh, just to clear up enough space for us to do that. So why don't we call it an episode here, guys, and I will just fish the day away. And we'll pick this up uh, probably tomorrow when we can go down and harvest all the undersea goodies. Oh, raw herring, and I didn't have any room to pick it up, and now it's gone underneath the thing. So, my bad. Thanks for watching, everybody. Leave a like and subscribe if you enjoy the raft gameplay. There'll be more coming. Stay safe, survivors.